Namaste, Dosto. Welcome to Mumbai. Okay, so we tried after midnight last night, two hours. Uh, not quite sure, but it was very difficult getting started. Not quite sure if that was the time frame or if I, I'm just getting worn out with all the dilating. But we shall see. My next dilation is due in a few minutes, so we'll see what happens there. Hi, how's it going? Welcome to another edition of Tub Time. Have another of my little bath there, so. Right, so. Two hour dilation. Yeah, it's working. The issue I'm having, whether it's one hour, one and a half hour, or two hour, it's become a little more, a bit more difficult with the two hour, is the initial start of the dilation. For some reason, it's just my crazy body, I have a lot of swelling to get through. On some through, everything goes smooth and grand. And so, on my last session, we started off with some digits. And that seemed to help a little. So, maybe that's the way to go, rather than jumping straight in with the dilator. Maybe not. I will take advice on that. Okay, so I've had my little bath, I've done the dilation, and now I've just had a nice shower. I shampoo and condition my hair. Oh, it feels so good. Good evening, and welcome to tonight's edition of Tub Time. Well, Today, we've been doing some dilation every two hours. It's been going grand. Like I said earlier, difficulty starting out. Once, once we're on a roll, we're on a roll. Uh, but our huge grand is up to the job. Well, he thinks he is. Don't they all? So, they took me today for some exercise, a walk around the market. It's fantastic. So many amazing things to see and smell. Oh, there was this darling wee fella. And someone pointed out he kept waving. So I waved back and he waved again. Oh, he was the sweetest wee thing. He really was. It'd break your heart if you'd seen him. So tiny. Uh, there's quite a few people, uh, younger people who are waving, so waving back. Oh, I'm sure it's grand. Uh, we saw a couple of child sisters. Uh, Jane went and spoke to them. And street tattoos. So many street tattoos. No hygiene. Oh. I should have brought my guns and a blanket and set up shop. I would have made a fortune. I can't believe it when I when I saw them. Uh, if you look up on YouTube, Indian street tattoos. And basically these people are sitting on the floor in the street now, on a blanket. Uh, and there's some photographs of tattoo flash that they clearly haven't done because they've all got the same photographs. And they have a little wee box with uh, an inkwell with some dirty ass ink in it. And usually a homemade tattoo machine or an eBay two quid from Hong Kong tattoo machine. I didn't see any sterile needles. I didn't see any gloves, face masks, any kind of aseptic technique going on. That'll be a no from me, thank you. <laughs> but, sure was grand to see that something like that, for real. I mean, obviously I, I've seen them on the YouTube before. Wow, just wow, there's so many of them. And so many clothes, the colors, oh, I could have spent a fortune if I'd had the money 
I could have gone berserk. I did get myself some nice jewellery. I did get myself some bindi. I'll start wearing bindi again from tomorrow. And a couple of other bits and barbs. I uh, got a couple of items that need to go to the tailors to be altered. So we shall just go along with those and see how I get them. Sure it's grand. And what a fantastic day out. Obviously, it meant it was a long time since my previous dilation. And it took me a good time to get back up to depth. I had to use some of the Lox cream that they give us. It's basically a lube, but it does have an anesthetic, mild anesthetic in it. I had to use that and digitally start everything. And once we freed things up, then we could start dilating with huge grant. Even then, after the warm up, it still took a bit of persuasion to get everything home where it's supposed to be until finally we were queefing like a queen again and sure as grand after that and now I'm having my tub and after my bath I'll be dilating again so that should get us back on course with everything all in all what a fantastic day fantastic experiences catch you all later so it's 2 a.m. I've just finished another dilation. This time we're going for three hours. So I'm going to get me some sleep. It's been such an awesome day. And to be mobile again, to go into the outside. Oh, it meant so much to me. It really did. I, I can't thank everyone at pre-med enough so see you all in three hours or so good night i love you bye bye